So this is graduate assistantships at California Institute of Technology, right? 2024, 2025. It's for masters and PhD students. It's in California, as you can see. Now this says, says full tuition. Um, so basically we have three different types of tuitions, uh, scholarships. So one is partial scholarship. Basically it covers less than just the tuition fees. We have full tuition, it covers just the tuition fees and it doesn't give you anything more. And then we have full funding scholarships, which means like it gives you the entirety of tuition fees. Uh, like it covers the tuition fees and then it gives you something more. Now this should be, uh, I'm not sure why it is classified as full tuition here. I'm gonna ask about this one to Eamon uh, because it should be, I think it should be full funding, right? And so basically, what is a graduate assistantship? So graduate assistantships are um, basically you go as a graduate student and work in the university. You can be a like a teaching assistant, you can be a research assistant, you can be a like administrative assistant. So basically you go and work at the university for about 20 hours a week and they cover your tuition fees, they give you some stipend, they like it's kind of being like being employed by the university. And if you want to find the perfect scholarship for yourself, go to our website globalscholarships.com and use our free search tool. Type in the program, university or the country you are interested in and see all the available scholarships. Use our filters to find the most suitable scholarship for yourself. It's completely free and doesn't even require registration. Find the perfect scholarship right now. Okay, being like an employee of the university. Um, so as you can see, this covers your tuition fees, monthly stipend, annual two-week vacation and institute holidays, and health insurance. So basically, it's like, uh, like, like the benefits are the things that you would expect from a job. So yeah, uh, this is like, so it's, it's very um, generous, but keep in mind that you have to work for it. So the university, again, California Institute of Technology is a very well-known university, very high-ranking university in the United States. As you can see, it's a very small school. We have two more scholarships. Let me actually see the, those ones. One is need-based financial aid, obviously. And we have two graduate scholarships. One is the graduate assistantship we're talking about, and the other is financial aid package. This one is also classified as full tuition, but it says it tuition fees and monthly stipend of salary. Um, I'm not sure. I'm going to ask about these two. Doesn't make any sense. Okay, so this is the university. We have more information here, like about admission process. Uh, like you can click any of click on any of these links to go to the university's page and learn more about the application process. We have the deadlines here, and as you can see, the tuition fees are about sixty thousand dollars a year, which is like the high end of uh, American tuition fees. Uh, so, like even for United States schools, it's kind of high. Uh, but this covers the entirety of this, which is about like $240,000, right? Yeah, uh, for four years. And this scholarship covers the entirety of that. But one very important thing to say about graduate assistantships are that you do not get these scholarships before you get into the university. So basically, you have to apply to the university as a um, graduate stu student and then you should be at, you, like you need to be admitted to the university and then after you are there after you go to the school and start your education then you can apply for the graduate assistantship so you cannot like you cannot depend on graduate assistantships to cover your uh living expenses your like your educational expenses okay so you have to have your own funds on on savings which for this university is very high um so you have to go there, start studying, but then if you get like uh, get this graduate assistantship, you will get to keep your own funds uh, and like spend them on anything you want, or like you know keep them for the future, etc. So you cannot depend on graduate assistantships uh, for your for ex like financing your education is what I'm saying. So yeah. Um, the university, if you want to see where the university is, so let's go and see the university and what it looks like. It's a very famous, very prestigious university. Here it is. California. It's in California, obviously. It's in Los Angeles, which have, like I have to say, is one of the most expensive places 
to live is Los Angeles. Like if you if you have any um, plan to uh, go and study in the United States, you know Los Angeles. So it's a very expensive place. So this is the university. Yep, there it is. Again, it's a very high-ranking, very uh, prestigious, very well-known university. I don't think I have to say much here about the university. This is the university. So scholarship. Um, we can get more information, like we have eligibility criteria on our page. By the way, this page I will leave the link for in um, the description or probably in comment section. So there are no pretty much no specific eligibility criteria. You just need to be an international master's and PhD student or applicant of California Institute of Technology. Application procedure, you can get more information by clicking here, like admission section and etc. Uh, we have deadlines here uh, we have master's admission page here and then if you want to get even more information about this scholarship uh, you can just see, go, click here to go to the official scholarship page of the university so as you can see here in website of caltech as you can see graduate assistantships sorry graduate assistants help with teaching laboratory work or perform research of research of a character that affords mm. useful academic experience while permitting a full academic schedule of course so you have to continue your education while working which is why the total work commitment cannot exceed 20 hours per week during the academic year summer appointments can be greater uh, with assignments of up to assignments up to 40 hours per week which means like you'll get uh, you'll get more obviously um, how much you get is not really, you can get more information about like different types of assistantships, uh, like teaching assistantships, research assistantships. Um, it doesn't say how much uh, the stipend is, but usually with a lot of universities in the United, Sa United States um, offering graduate assistantships, basically usually stipends are uh, amounts that you can live on in that specific place because like clearly if if they employ you as an as an assistant and then they give you an give you a stipend that you cannot really live in los angeles you won't be able to work there right so usually it's something that will allow you to live like barely um, afford living there can we get any information here maybe prize and awards no nothing about Let's you know what. Let's say graduate. No, no graduate assistantships. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty much it for the scholarship. Again, like um, you cannot really depend. Like, you cannot really base your entire financial plan on this one. But if you get it, it's it's a really good scholarship. So keep that in mind. And that's pretty much it for this one. Graduate assistantships at California Institute of Technology.